it's Rob Guidas. I'm at the lab. I'm here today um, to demonstrate the micrometer impression adjustment and how it works on the standard Crest clamshell die cutter. Now I want to set up to do a kiss cut um, of this uh, 3M material, this metallized material, and I want to find out exactly where that die is located. So I have a piece of uh, uh, polyester film and I'm going to bring it up until I get an image in my film so that I can use that to locate the substrate for the job. Now I'm currently at the neutral point, which is, which is 21. I'm not making an image yet, so I'm going to turn the micrometer to the left, counterclockwise. Nice zero, one, two, three, back to zero. This the micrometer is, uh, it, it's marked in zero, one, two, three, zero. Each line is a half a thousandth of an inch. That's critical for your precision of adjustment when you're doing kiss cut. Now, when I go from zero to zero, it took me from 21 to 22. I'm gonna do the same on the left side. Zero, one, two, three, zero. And you see if I'm now making contact. And I am. I can now see a, just a very slight outline of the side of this of the substrate. Now I'm going to bring it up a little bit more, but I do not want to cut through. So this time I'm going to go to one to two. Essentially that's half a turn. So I'm between 22 and 23. I'm right in the middle of that. One, two. Okay, now I can see my outline of the die very nicely. That's going to allow me to put the substrate, the film, underneath of this to locate it, which will now allow me to put my registration stops in. Okay, now I'm going to take a picture of this to show you. Um, and now we can see the outline of the die, we're not die cutting, and the substrate. Now I can put my registration stops in, remove the film, and begin the make ready process for the impression, make, begin the impression process for uh, kiss cutting.